Happy Monday. Welcome on into the Faithful Studio. I am Faithfully Bearded that Tyson, is and this is... Aubrey and Bearded. Wait, Sunday. It's Sunday. We're recording this video for Monday. We're doing the unboxing today. It's... It's Sunday! It's Sunday. You're hearing it first from Aubrey and Bearded. And we have a package today that we're going to unbox right here. This nice little priority mailbox. And this is coming from All Things Earthy. All Things Earthy. I found this company on Instagram. I checked them out. I looked at the carrier blend. I was like, this looks kind of cool. And from what I know, it's a female barber. That's all I know. But I'm going to find out more this week and bring you a review on Friday. So if you're interested in that, make sure you hit the what button? Uh, the subscribe button and hit the bell. Hit the bell so you know when all the videos come out. And you never know when Aubrey on Bearded is going to come in because... I mean, we're on lockdown. We're doing homeschooling. <laughs> and so she's learning at home. She's here. She's available. And she can make special appearances anytime, right? Yep. Oh, oh what yeah. do we got in there? We got Aubrey chores for me. We got Aubrey chores. Show those out. <laughs> Look. <laughs> I have like marshmallow and. So I ordered uh, quite a few things from them. I just went on to their website. <laughs> And I ordered some oils and stuff from them. I wanted to try them out. I thought the packaging looked pretty good. So everything is coming in these bubble wrappers here. Ooh, yay for me to pop! And I'll show you some stuff. I'll show you what they look like and then we get them out of here, right? Oh, I have something. Oh, you got an oil. Oh, don't open it yet. Let me open first. We'll open them together. Let's get this stuff all unwrapped here. So you got a, a wash here or a conditioner, something. Uh, beard oh. wash conditioner. Yeah, there we go. Am I right? Yeah, beard you, wash you, conditioner. you probably are. We got Aubrey on bearded over there just popping bubbles. And this is Pinkie Pie on bearded from Amazon. Pinkie Pie on bearded from the Amazon. You yeah. know, the interwebs, the WWWs, which I don't think you really need WWW anymore. That must be from like the 90s or something. Probably, yeah. We got some balm, we got some butter. And we got a lot of bubble wrap, so you can see how the rest of my day is going to be listening to bubble popping. And then we have just my order uh, notes right there. Um, and that's it. So we'll get that out of here. Shouldn't clean that up later. We'll go. All right. So the first thing that I have right here, let's take a look at these labels up a little bit closer here. We ha I oh, found it's a card. not focusing on this. Look, I found the card that looks, see? Yeah. Oh, here's a card she found. Watch this, Dad. Thank you, from the coast of Maine. So these are from Maine. And that's what kind of got me, because I know there's some other companies in Maine. And <laughs> the labels kind of struck me as nice. Now I'm going to go through here, and I'm going to get this, uh, this stuff off of here. And what my pal, Michael Cribbs, Beard Swag, calls yeah. this is, is garbage. I call it a seal. You know, it seals the lid. Call it some Aubrey chores, maybe. Um, but this one right here, here you go. It's called the Sixth Sense. And what we have here is nine nutrient-rich oils to promote growth, benefit skin, and hair growth. So you got argan oil, jojoba oil, vitamin E, sweet almond, apricot kernel, avocado kernel, pumpkin seed oil, hemp seed oil, grape seed oil, and then uh, scent it with essential oils. Get those out of your mouth, you seal. So let's see what this is. I don't see... It doesn't say anywhere on there what it's supposed to be. It's called the sixth scent. <laughs> Ooh, that is good. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, um, I, I like that. Ooh, it smells like cotton candy. It smells like cotton candy. Nope, not really. You're wrong. Um... It smells more like a bubble gum to me, so I think there might be some tobacco in it. Like a really, it's a really sweet-ish uh, tobacco. I'll get scent profiles for you guys before the review. And then you got Mich Mi mischief maker, mischief, mischief. I want to smell. Mischief. There we go. Look at that label. That's pretty awesome here. Same ingredients here. Uh, mischief maker. Let's shake a roo. Get the sniffer ready. I'm ready. No, me like me so. I think it's like a flowerish. It does smell kind of flowerish. It's it smells like a flowery cologne. Type yeah, is yeah, kind of what I, I get out of it. Flowery cologne, maybe. Yeah, All I right. think so. Okay, so we agree. We agree on that one. It's kind of flowery yeah. and cologne. 
And then you have Midnight <laughs> Joe. Midnight I Joe. I want to smell Midnight Joe. Oh, we're going to smell it. Midnight Joe. Camera's not focusing. It's hard when there's two people in here, huh? Ooh, I that's smell, a really um, nice cologne. This is really cologne smell. scent. Just a nice, straight up, little oh, bit of a sweet like cologne. Night smells John. like Midnight Joe, yeah. And then we have one called Vintage. Vintage. Uh, there's a couple companies with the name Vintage. and I mean, you can't... Watch this how many guy. different names for beard oil can you come up with, right? So let's we'll shake this up. Let me see if I can get you guys a view of this, if the camera's going to work. There we go. I'm going to have some peanuts. And let's peanuts. smell this one here. Give me peanuts. Okay, so this is going to be like your vintage barber shop scent. I'm ripping peanuts. I'm ripping Yeah, that's a, that's a barber shop. What's this smell like to you? Oh, it's kind of, I don't smell like, a, I only smell like a little scent. You? A little scent. And then you got a uh, Mischief Maker Ooh. Beard Wash. Ooh. Like, holy moly, like these labels are nice. This is a big bottle. Um, this looks good. I like this. Let's see what it smells like here. So you got the, the push top topper here. You got a seal. Let's just break the seal. No, not the seal of the drinking game where you break the first seal and then you got to pee every five minutes. I don't smell any chemicals or nothing like that. It smells to me just like uh, the Mischief Maker oil that I just had. I don't see anything out of the normal here. I'm ripping peanuts. I'll have to research them a little bit more. Uh, but then you also have a beard conditioner. Now, I'm interested because it said conditioner. That's what interested me about it. It didn't say co-wash. It said conditioner. Uh, they're two different things in my mind. So I want to see if this is a more traditional conditioner or if it's a co-wash. Co-wash. So let's just look at it here. Let's just see. Yeah, and to me that looks like it's going to be a conditioner. It's thick. Let me see. I want to see. Smell it. it. I don't smell anything. Yeah, it smells good. That smells really good. I like that. So to me this smells, or this, the texture seems like it's going to be a conditioner. It's that real thick, nice stuff that's really going to go in and moisturize your hair. And then I got what they call a beard cream. So here you got beard, beard cream. It's in this black container. I wish the label would go around, but it doesn't. It's a two ouncer it says. Feels a little, a little little for two ounces. This container might be two ounces, but I don't know if you can get two ounces into it. And I got Mischief Maker again in this, as you can see. It's a, it's a, it's a full, it's a bodied, ma oh man, this has some body. This has some good body on it for a, Watch this, Dad. a cream butter. I mean, yeah, cream makes sense because it's more like a cream to me. I feel like this is going to have some hold on it. That's interesting. Let's see what the ingredients are. Shea butter, argan oil. Okay, so shea butter and then their normal but carrier lineup. And then I got the Midnight Joe oil, uh, balm here. And something that I don't, I already noticed I don't like is it's a pull top. Not a fan of pull tops. Not in this world. Hey, come on. I like you twist know? tops. You pull them, you drop them, and they fall off. But you got a beautiful white color. Yeah. Smells exactly like uh, the oil. Feels like it's a, a medium to a little bit heavier of a medium of a hold. Took a little bit of nail to get out of there. And you got shea butter, white beeswax, and then the carrier blend. So you got this with some, you got the beeswax in there to give it a little bit of a hold. Yeah, we got a mess. She's destroying over here. So this is what I think. I'm gonna come in on the Faithful Ranker score to give them initial FRS score. I'm gonna bring them in an 8.6, and then we're gonna wear this all week long. I'm gonna talk to them, and I'm gonna come back to you on Friday and let you know what I think. And the final FRS score, hopefully have like a discount or a giveaway of something for you guys. So make sure you tune in. If you found this video useful, make sure to leave a comment below. If you've heard of this company, hit that subscribe button, the thumbs up, and the bell. So you're on top of all things Faithfully Bearded. So until I talk to you guys again soon. God bless you all. God bless you all, as she said. Have a great day. Thank you for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button, that thumbs up, and that bell. Turn on all your notifications so you know when we come out with new content. You can also find us at faithfullybearded.com, on Facebook, on Instagram, and on your favorite podcast network. Just search Faithfully Bearded on your favorite podcast app. God bless.